In this tutorial, I will show how to create a double exposure. So, once you have your image ready, make a copy layer, by pressing Ctrl or Command J on a Windows or Mac respectively. Now press Ctrl I to open the levels window. Make the blacks to 17, and whites to 234, and press OK. Then click on the effects button below, and select gradient overlay. Change the blend mode to multiply. Click on the arrow, and select black and white gradient. You can also click on the gradient bar, and select the black and white gradient from there. Now change the angle to minus 180 degree and press OK. Then create a mask layer. Select the brush tool or press B, and make sure your foreground color is black. Now apply over the image, to restore its original glow on the face and hands. Now we will go over to our second image, with which we will create the double exposure. Select the image, and drag it to the file we are working on. Press Ctrl T to resize it, now right click, and select rotate 90 degree clockwise. You can reposition it using the Move tool, and transform by pressing Ctrl T. Drag the tropical tree image, halfway over the background image. Once you have repositioned it, create a mask layer, and make the foreground color to black. Select the brush tool, or press B, and carefully apply over the image, where both images look combined. If you want to bring on the areas of the tropical trees, press X to change the foreground color to white. Apply over areas you want back. Now, select the background layer, and create a new layer. Bring it below the background layer and fill it with white, using the paint bucket tool. And there you go. A perfect double exposure.